Responders often don't get to deliver the best news, but for two Attleboro firefighters, they delivered. The paramedics stepped up when a woman gave birth before her ambulance arrived at the hospital. Eyewitness News reporter Shana Lashuto has their story new tonight. The firefighters tell me when they get dispatched to a call, they prepare themselves for what they're about to head into. Now they've seen a lot of different scenarios, but this was a first. There's a happy call instead of a sad call. As a firefighter paramedic, you see it all. Oh, absolutely. absolutely, this will be with us for the rest of our career. So when you get a call for a woman going into labor, you're on your way. And I just figured it was probably going to be just a routine transport. <laughs> And uh, it was far from that. <laughs> Firefighters Ryan Balawa and Cameron Eames with the Attleboro Fire Department respond to a home just before 4 Wednesday morning. The expecting mother seems calm and collected, but says she's having some contractions. Still doesn't feel real. <laughs> Suddenly, things take a quick turn. So as soon as she sat down on the stretcher, he got into the uh, driver's seat. We just wanted to get to the hospital. and. En route to the hospital, she started to tell me that the baby was coming out and I needed to do something. It went from a three passenger ride to, to four. And by the time we got to the hospital, he was backing in. He opened the doors. I had the baby in my hands. That wasn't the only surprise either. She never found out the gender of the uh, baby, so I was able to share that with her. With the help of these two, Attleboro proudly welcomes a happy, healthy baby and a story of a lifetime. And according to the fire department, both mom and baby are doing just fine. At last check, they were at Sturdy Memorial Hospital. Reporting live in the newsroom, I'm Sheena Loshudo, Eyewitness News.